Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys all of the best money methods to do this week in GTA 5 Online. As you guys know, Expanded and Enhanced is only three days away from now, and if you guys are looking into making money before Expanded and Enhanced comes out, this is going to be the best way for you guys to be grinding money. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys a total of five different money methods. But yeah, if you guys do go on to enjoy or learn anything new, definitely do me a favor, go down below and drop a like. Also, hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on a future GTA 5 video from me. But now, let's get straight into the first money method. All right, so for this first money method, we're going to be doing the short trip missions. Now, if you guys do not know how to start this up, you simply need to press the pause menu, come over here to online, then click jobs, go down to play job, go down to rockstar created, then go down to missions and just scroll until you guys see the short trip missions. You can see these short trip missions are going to be paying double money and double RP this entire week. So go ahead and start up whichever one of these missions you guys want to. You can see right here, I started up the one right here called OG Kush. But yeah, for all these missions, you're only going to need one other person to help you do this mission with and you and your friend at the end of the mission are going to end up getting paid the same exact amount of money so it's not like you're going to get paid more than him you guys get paid equally and it's also going to be a really good amount which i'm going to show at the end anyway most of these missions are pretty simple to do for this one that i'm doing right now all i had to do was get inside of the ld organics van with my friend who was doing the mission with me and then we had to go over to a destination where we basically had to take out a whole bunch of people and once we took out all of those people we just had to make our way back over to the city and then that was literally it for the mission now in total this mission probably took me about 14 to 15 minutes to complete which isn't that long you're also going to want to aim to be in this mission for a little bit over 15 minutes that way you get paid the complete max amount of money that the mission can possibly give you anyway let me show you guys how much money i got paid at the end of the mission and here's how much you're also going to get paid every time you complete one of these missions a little bit over 15 minutes you can see mission pass and here's how much money i ended up getting paid a flat one hundred thousand dollars and take a look at the rp i got a total of around 2100 rp which isn't that bad and this is sure going to be one of the top ways for you guys to be earning money this week Anyway, getting into the next money method, we're going to be doing the time trial. Now, if you guys do not know where the time trial is located for this week, it's going to be located right here on the map. You can see it's kind of close to the Mount Chiliad Mountain. So make your way over here. And once you guys are over here, call out a fast motorcycle, such as the Batty 801, the Shitaro, or Hukucho Drag Bike. Basically, just any fast motorcycle that you guys own. Once you guys get that fast motorcycle, get on top of it and then come over to the time trial. Next, what you're going to want to do is get your motorcycle and come up to the time trial and angle it just like I'm angling my bike right here. Once you guys are facing this exact direction, whenever you guys are ready, simply click right on the D-pad to start up the time trial and take this exact route that I'm taking. I'm actually not going to speed up this week's uh, time trial because you guys need to know exactly what to do because I'm not going to lie. This week's time trial is a little bit difficult, but don't worry because as long as you do it exactly how I'm doing right now, you should be able to beat it. Of course, there's really not too much explaining to do here. Just do exactly what I'm doing on my screen and try to memorize it that way when you do it you do it first try and you don't have any problems of course while doing this time trial and going up the mountain make sure you're holding rt all the way down as much as possible and also your left joystick all the way up that way you're basically going the max speed a lot of people think that wheeling is better but if you're holding up on your left joystick it's making it so you're going the same exact speed as a wheelie but without worrying about you know falling off because when you do wheelies and if you hit a little bump it'll end up making you fall off your motorcycle anyway once you guys get up the mountain and you're right here at this part right here it should be around 50 seconds if you guys are up here around 50 seconds that's how you know you might beat the time trial now this part right here coming up is going to be probably the most difficult part so come up this mountain and right here once you take this left turn you're going to need to hit the uh, rock exactly as i do here so go super fast and then hit this rock it should bank you up just like this and now you should beat the time trial and here's how much money you get when you beat it one hundred and one thousand dollars so hopping straight into the next money method, we're going to be doing the double money and double RP adversary mode for this week. So simply press your pause menu, come over here to online and then go to jobs, then go to play jobs, then go to rockstar created, go to adversary modes and scroll all the way until you guys see the hunting pack remix game mode. You guys can see this game mode is going to be double money and double RP this entire week. And it's going to be really good for earning money and also RP. As far as settings go for this game mode though, simply put team balancing set to on and then put first to win set to five rounds. Now five rounds is the max amount of rounds that you guys can do in this game mode so just keep that in mind because you can't go higher than that 
Anyway, once you guys have these settings, try to get as many people in the game as possible. And most of you guys already know this because I say it in every single one of my money method videos. But the reason you want as many people as possible in the game with you is because you're going to end up getting paid more money and more RP at the end of the entire game mode. Because the more people you guys have, you're going to end up earning more money every single round and also more RP. And as you guys know, Expanded and Enhanced is dropping on March 14th, and right before it drops on March 14th at night, I'm going to be live streaming right before it actually releases. And in that live stream, we are for sure all going to be playing this game mode. So I recommend you guys get as much practice as possible because this is one of my best game modes. I'm super good at this game mode, so I want to see the best talent there on that live stream. Hopefully I see all of you guys there. Anyway, if you guys have never played this game mode before, it's super straightforward. Once you guys are on the Scramjet team, all you have to do is try your best to try to knock over that MTL Dune, which is that big truck. And if you guys knock him over enough times, he's going to end up uh, blowing up if he doesn't move fast enough. And if he does end up blowing up, you end up winning the round. You can see right now we actually ended up winning the round because we made him blow up and we crashed him enough times. And here's how much money in RP you get every single round. Now, I know it's not a lot, but at the end, it actually adds up. You can see winning team got paid 5000 almost 6000 Losing team got paid around $3,000. Now, once you guys are on the Scramjet team, the next round, you're going to end up being on the Vigilante team, which is a team with the big truck which is called the MTL Dune. Of course, I'm pretty sure you guys already know what you have to do when you're on this team. You basically have to try to get this truck all the way over to the destination without getting crashed or wrecked by the other uh, scram jets on the other team. So just try your best to be as fast as possible to make it to the checkpoint. And if you guys do make it to the checkpoint, like I just did right here, you'll end up winning the round and you actually get paid a bit more money compared to the scram jet team. You can see we are the round winners. Here's how much money we got paid. $10,000 and the losing team got paid $5,700. $700. But now just fast forwarding at the end of the game once your team ends up winning of course here's how much money you get paid you can see we are the match winner and we got paid a total of $70,000 just short of $71,000 and take a look at the RP that we earned it is 7,000 RP which is actually not that bad. And even money and RP aside, this game mode is very fun. I recommend all of you guys to play it, especially with a set of friends. If you guys have like a set of, I don't know, four to eight friends, this is for sure a game mode I highly recommend you guys to go play. Anyway, let's now get into the very last money method in today's video. All right, so getting into the very last money method, we're going to be doing the RC Bandito time trial for this week. And if you guys do not know where it's located, it's going to be located right here on the map. So make your way over here to this exact location. Once you guys are over here, though, simply walk up to the RC Bandito time trial and click right on the D-pad to start it once you guys are ready. As soon as you guys start it, though, just be careful not to crash and try to go as fast as possible. But of course, you don't have to go insanely fast. Make sure you guys take your time. That way you don't end up crashing. That's just basically the only thing you want to do. I know I keep saying it, but the goal is just not to crash. And if you don't crash, you should be able to beat it pretty easily. And once you guys end up beating it, here's how much money you end up getting paid. You can see right now I'm coming up to the very end of the time trial and you guys will get paid a total of one hundred and one thousand dollars, which is very good for only like a minute and 30 seconds of doing a simple RC Bandito time trial. Anyway, like I said, that's going to be the last money method in today's video. Hopefully you guys did go on to enjoy. If you guys did go on to enjoy today's video, definitely do me a favor. Go down below and drop a like. Also hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on a future GTA 5 video from me. And like I said, Expanded and Enhanced is going to be dropping on March 14th at night. So at March 14th at night, I'm going to be live streaming a few hours before the game actually gets released. Definitely make sure you guys have the post notifications turned on. That way you do not miss out on my live stream. I hope to see all of you guys there. But that's going to be it for today's video. Hope you guys did go on to enjoy. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.